Okay guys, since I said I would, I am going to show you the classic ribbon on all of my event Pokemon to show it matches Uton's and his are real. Apparently had a faithful counter. It should say that because it's not really supposed to be mine. That's got decent EVs, yada yada yada. This is my untouched one. So a commemorative ribbon obtained at a mystery location. Doesn't that look familiar? Well guess what? Good to see it again. By the way, that's my legit Japanese one. I like it very much. Legit Dark Cry. Other legit Dark Cry. And my other Deoxys. Which is also a classic ribbon. A community ribbon obtained at a mysterious location. Anybody see a, you know, recurring thing here? It's because they're all the same. And I'm even going to switch over to Platinum. Event Pichu, which by the way, they're all jolly. If it's not jolly, it's not right. Hey. Oh, wait, you can't see it. Hmm. To come out a ribbon obtained at in a mysterious location. That looked familiar. Let's go to the next one. My American Shaman. Untouched. Hmm. You know, I'm starting to see a trend here. And I'll just end with my event Arceus. Which is legit because it activated the event. And only legit Arceus can do that. Just like only legit Shaman can activate the Gracie Diaz flower event. I hope this trend kind of points things out to you. And while I'm talking here, and I will let you look at my pretty Arceus, I'll even show you that it's a really sucky nature. Because it's quiet. We're going to start with the event Arceus. July 18th is right. This is about the time the movie actually came out. This is when the event pretty much started. Pokemon Movie 09 does not mean it's the ninth movie. It's Pokemon Movie, which is the 12th movie, 2009. It's shortened for 09. These, yes. Apparently had a faithful encounter. If it says you had a faithful encounter, you either have some really stupid luck because it is guaranteed to have the same secret idea as you do, or you hacked it. And highly persistent like dry food. And I can show you mine's untouched because, as you can see, not the best stats in the world. Actually, that special attack looks pretty good. I'm gonna have to check that. But uh, pretty much. That's where it should be from. That's what its ID number should be. And as you can see, this is not an American. Which is the easiest way to tell if it's a hack. If it's an American, it's a hack. It's got the cherish ball, came with the raw berry. Now we're going to go to the other one everyone seems to have a problem with the event Pichu. Yes, it's in Japanese. And yes, that's the right OT, and that is the right ID. If your OT looks nothing like that, it's fake. And as you can see, it is untouched. Wait. Untouched. Anyways. Sorry that the camera's a little bit low, I'm kind of close to it. Like with the DS and all, and the camera. Um, Jolly Nature, which is right. This is when the event happened. I'm pretty sure I can always look it up again, but I am... 95% sure that is when the event happened, June 19th, or around the time the event happened. Um, as you can see, ninth movie, because it's a Pokemon from the ninth movie. You see this in the ninth movie, apparently. And the Notch Tree Pichu, which you only get that in Heart Cold Soul Silver. Apparently had a faithful encounter at level 30. Apparently had a faithful encounter. Little trick here, all Pokemon that don't have the same secret ID as you, even if they randomly have the same OT ID, which they shouldn't, It'll say apparently had, or apparently, or whatever. Because it's apparently because you're not the one who did it, so you aren't sure. But yeah, it's the game talking. Mm, somewhat stubborn, yada yada. It's not the great stats in the world. All its moves, which are clearly event moves. And the classic ribbon. And just because I feel like showing off Shaman, I soft reset for that thing. That's why it's on February 12th, and it's my... 
If I remember that, that was Valentine's Day. That's my Valentine's Day present. Apparently had a faithful encounter. That's what it should say. It also should be from True. It should have that OT. This is my English one. My other one really sucks. All the event moves. As you can see. Mystery Zone. And just because I love showing off, which I so do, back to Diamond. This is going to be the last one I'm going through. I'm just only going to show a three or four event Pokemon. This is the GameStop one. Yes, that's how the GameStop's supposed to look. It's English, came with the Never Melt Ice, which I have no idea why. Um, mine's modest, I soft reset for that to get that. Um, those are all the moves it comes with. It comes with Iron Defense, which my Defense Deoxys doesn't have, it has Cosmic Power. It comes with Zap Cannon, Psycho Boost, and Extreme Speed. All these moves are different moves from each of the, uh, yeah, each of the forms. And, as you can see, Classic Ribbon doesn't lie. That's how it's supposed to look. And, just because I mentioned him earlier, that's what the uh, Shaman's supposed to be. And, for those who are saying, well, how are you sure this is legit? I'm going to actually have some fun with this. One, oh wait, 2008. Um, the, both Arceus and Shaman came from the Egaton Theater, which is why it has Egaton or whatever as its OT and ID number. I'm going to slow, I'm going to zoom in so you can see it completely. Sorry for that, my camera's not the greatest. And it can't focus, of course. Go back, go back. Sorry about this. Alright, there it is. Now, I gave you a really close look of it. Now we're going to go over uh, the DS screen and look at Arceus's. If you look at how the symbols are shown, you know, right there, they are the same as Shaman. Same place, same OT. Hopefully this clears everything up. If anyone has any questions or... I don't know, once an event Pokemon, because I have spares, because I like getting spares. Just ask, I guess, if I feel in the mood to trade. I did offer somebody an event, De uh, Deoxys, I think, once upon a time. But, yeah. I, for everyone who's like, oh, Uton's user hacked because of the ribbon and whatever, they're not. And by the way, if your Pichu does not have a jolly nature, guess what? It's not legit. And uh, that's Mrs. Kenrick signing off. And hopefully this sounds better than I do with the mic. Don't ask me why that works. Oh, I might as well, you know, throw in a little, you know, what's coming thing. Pokemon of the Week will be done by Thunder. Dude, I cannot thank you enough for doing this. Reason will be, I'm leaving Sunday. I won't be here Monday to post it. I'm giving him everything. He's posting it for me. I asked him if you do it, he was happy, or seemed happy to help. I'm sorry to throw this on to you, because I, I know you already have uh, the news, the weekly news video, but you've helped me out a lot, man. And hopefully this clears everything up. And there may, be, and once I get the chance, there will be a battle up. I'm trying to finish the new intro before I put the battle up. So this is Kenrick, signing off.